Hello my mermaids and welcome back to the channel. I'm so excited to have you back once again and I'm so excited to be here with you all today. So today I'm going to be talking to you about my top five fragrances that I believe are head turners, man killer, woman killer, whoever you're trying to attract, whatever you're trying to do. These fragrances are definitely going to do that for you. Now, I have talked about these fragrances in the past. Uh, some you haven't heard me talk about and some you have heard me talk about and some are just going to be reoccurring every time I talk about a perfume video because they're just my absolute favorite and I just can't see myself not having these fragrances in my life. I have all the notes in each fragrance down below. Also, um, with me learning fragrances and what I like, what I don't like, um and just the proper terminology for everything i'm learning that i love oriental scents i love warm scents that make me feel just so beautiful inside make me feel sexy make me feel you know powerful and strong and independent and um just bossy and loud i love fragrance that are loud obnoxious but not offensive to someone else's nose um even if it is offensive to your nose, I honestly don't really care because it just, I, I wear my fragrances for me, but I also secretly wear fragrances for other people because one of my favorite compliments in the whole wide world is you smell so good. I feel like out of even you're beautiful or uh, I love your outfit or I love your makeup, it's something about hearing someone say that you smell so good for me that just makes me feel really good inside and it just you know and somebody wants to know what perfume i'm wearing i always tell people what perfume i'm wearing if they ask me i'm not one of those people that just don't want people to smell like me i'm never going to see you again or you know if i'm out and about or, so i don't care like it just it doesn't really matter to me so it's not a secret for me um when it comes to fragrances alina stop my cat you guys my cat okay so this is going to be my top five. I don't know what the title of the video is going to be yet. Uh, Man Killer 2022. Uh, top five 2022 fragrances everybody should have in their collection. I don't know. But like I said before, my favorite is Gourmand. Or is, uh, I'm sorry. Um, my favorite fragrances are Oriental fragrances. Okay. Uh, so let's get into number five. Number five is going to be Hypnotic by hypnotic poison by dior now i have to be honest when i first smelled this i did not understand what all the hype was about this fragrance this is an oldie but a goodie for a lot of people i know that people said that they wore this in high school middle school um like for an example my aunt said that this was one of her favorites back in the day i'm a little bit late to the program i bought this last year i want to say in april and it took me some time to actually get used to this fragrance because when I first put it on I kept feeling like I kept saying to myself it smells like clay like I keep smelling clay like I don't know I just kept smelling clay but it's actually I believe the vanilla that is in it again I'm running out this is I'm low on this uh let me spray it right here um I just was like, oh my God, like I smell clay. Like I just, I just didn't like it. But as it dries down, you guys, it is very beautiful. And I just kept, since I bought it, like I just kept reaching for it, kept reaching for it, kept reaching for it. So this is definitely in my top five. I get a lot of compliments when I wear this. I feel sexy. I feel beautiful. Um, this is an all day. You can wear this all day. All day. You can wear it at night. Um, you can wear it in the summertime. You can wear it in the winter time. You can wear this whenever you want. And when it dries down, when it dries down, oh my God, it just gives me vanilla. I don't even know if it has vanilla in it. Again, I'm going to have the notes in each, um, each fragrance in the description box. But I smell in this, I smell warm, vanilla, uh, comforting, very comforting. A nice warm day when you're sitting on the couch cozied up on the couch with your partner fireplace burning valentine's day i would wear this on valentine's day i would wear this at night i would wear this going to bed i would wear this after a shower of a long day this is a person um hypnotic poison i think that is the perfect name for this um you guys i have lipstick on my teeth i'm sorry um 
oh my god it just it just very warm very warm very beautiful scent um if i can describe someone who wears this i would say this is someone who uh, a young woman um i would let my middle schooler wear this this is not too sexy but it smells really really good i feel like it's very appropriate for all ages in my opinion if i had a daughter and she wanted to wear this I would let my daughter wear this in middle school it is not too grown in my opinion but it, it's, it's just it's it's a very beautiful warm welcoming scent it's not overpowering it's not in your face too much but it's the perfect in your face for me because i love in your face fragrances um it does last this this has very good lasting power it smells so good you guys it's so warm and just oh my gosh it smells amazing in my opinion and this is definitely number five for me this is number five for me fragrances that you should have head turners um and just fragrances that you should have in your collection in my opinion the next fragrance i don't have it i, I gave it away um to one of my aunts because she doesn't have any perfumes and i was I, after i gave it to her because <laughs> it's so funny because i really wanted to help her and help her with her you know fragrances and getting into perfume and stuff like that i kind of regretted giving it to her because i love that fragrance so much um i didn't wear it that much and i had just bought it but this is the ysl black opium YSL Black Opium, you guys, it smells so good. It's so, um, it's a bossy fragrance. I think I have a dupe for it. Is this that one or Okay, so I actually have a dupe. I was sent a dupe for YSL Black Opium from a company. Um, so... It's not going to be the black opium, but this is it's going to remind me of the black opium. Okay, black opium straight off the bat. Like I said, this is a dupe. It smells just like black opium. Black opium, I would wear at night. You can wear it anytime you want. You can wear it in the summer. You can wear it in the winter. You can wear it in the fall. You can wear black opium whenever you want to wear it. Black opium is a beautiful... I wouldn't even really say beautiful black opium is in your face it's confident it's bossy it's a woman who knows what she wants she is independent she is sexy she loves to wear maybe all black all black everything maybe um little black dress i would wear this at night i would wear this this is oh my goodness that smells so good you guys it smells so good i'm gonna have the notes in the description box black opium is a game changer you gotta have it in your collection it makes you feel really good about yourself it has a touch of sweet to it just a touch not too much not over the top because i'm not really big on sweet scents but it has a touch of sweet it smells incredible you feel good wearing it um i would say you can wear it in your 20s 30s 40s I think it's appropriate for all ages, but I will wear this black opium at night, little black dress, date night. Um, you're going to get compliments. It's also a compliment or men love black opium. So definitely think about getting black opium in your collection. I think it's really important for women to have at least three perfumes in rotations. You need perfumes that make you feel certain type of ways because each fragrance brings out different things to your personality and just ah uh, yummy oh my gosh so bomb you feel I, when i wear a black opium you guys and i have to get another bottle but i do have the not the um i do have the one that is kind of similar to black opium basically the the dupe for black opium but it smells incredible black opium lasts on me um i don't have to it has projection it lasts very good lasting power and it smells incredible uh evening time wear all black everything independent woman um i love those type of friends those type of fragrances independent woman all black everything that's my style that's me um little touch of sweet a small touch of sweet 
um and it's just gonna make you feel so good so definitely try ysl black opium and you're not gonna regret it okay now the next one is going to be baccarat you guys baccarat rouge by mason francis this fragrance is so bomb i don't wear this very often you guys i bring this out on special occasions because this fragrance is nothing i've ever smelled before oh my god it smells incredible it has fruit in it i do believe that it does have fruit in it it's this is just this represents luxury for me like just extremely luxury classy timeless unisex men women can wear it men or women can wear this fragrance um, if a man was wearing this, I could see a man wearing this with a suit. He's a businessman. This is just, this represents luxury to me. Like, pure luxury. Oh, my God. I got to put that somewhere. Let me spray that right here. Um, Baccarat does not last. It does have progression. It does have projection. It doesn't last all day. You would have to, if you're going to be out all day, you would have to spray it twice a day, I would say, if you're going to be wearing it all day. Um, I don't see this being my signature scent. This is definitely something, yeah, this is my scent that I have and I love it, but this would not be my signature scent, something that I would wear every day, all day. I bring this baby out um, on special occasions. Now, if you don't want to pay this price, because this has a very big price tag for this, I would go with the Ariana Cloud. I gave my Ariana Cloud away. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. This just smells like money. The best way that I can describe it is Baccarat. It smells like money. This is somebody who has money. This is somebody who's successful, wealthy, um, you know, loves the finer things in life. This is what Baccarat represents for me. Wealth, luxury, abundance, success and someone who knows how to dress someone who i don't know this is just this is just money this just represents money to me smells so good i think you should get this in your collection i also believe that if you don't want to spend the money on this you can get the ariana cloud which smells exactly like that they literally took everything from this fragrance and put it in the ariana grande cloud so if i don't want to use this because this is my baby and it's so expensive i will go with the ariana Grande, day and you guys will not be disappointed no one would know that you have ariana grande on you can literally tell them i'm having i have baccarat on or they'll tell you that you have baccarat on because that's how close it is so yes this is number three you guys love 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 this fragrance it smells so good mmm it just smells like luxury you guys all right so the next one is going to be good girl by catalina herrera this is my second bottle you guys i just find myself constantly grabbing this fragrance i'm constantly whenever i'm getting dressed to go out it's evening time i want to feel sexy i am grabbing good girl every time i love good girl good girl you guys where am i gonna put this at i'm gonna put it right here good girl and um you guys i had the small one this one oh good girl good girl smells so good you guys good girl is a man eater men love good girl men compliment good girl all the time on me when I have it on, it smells powerful. It smells sex. This is a very sexy scent. I believe that it's appropriate for 20 and up. Very appropriate for the evening time, little black dress. This is little black dress. The way this heel looks, this is what you're going to do for this perfume when you're going out. Now, can you wear it all day, every day? Of course. But it's very strong. It is crazy projection. You're going to get a lot of compliments. Men, women, children, boys and girls. Everybody's going to be complimenting you on this fragrance. It smells so good. It's classy. It's timeless. This is someone who is very classy. This is someone who um, is very confident in who she is. 
um who he is whoever wants to wear it um very very sexy i would ask for this for a valentine's day gift i would ask for this for christmas i would ask for this on birthday um any of these you can ask for on special occasions but for valentine's day honey you put this on you gotta be careful because you might end up getting a scorpio baby i'm telling you men love this fragrance you guys it is incredible you can never lose wearing this fragrance and it just feels warm it feels sexy i would wear this all year round most people will probably say they would wear this around the winter time, fall time. I would wear this all year round. That's how good it smells. This is number two for me, you guys. Number two, it smells incredible, divine, sexy, um, classy, elegant. Oh my God. Sexy. Just, it's sexy. Literally sexy. Oh my God. Oh my God. It smells so good. Oh, now. Mmm. All right, you guys. Now, last but certainly not least, this is my all-time favorite perfume, you guys. I have never smelled a perfume that beats this fragrance. This is Alien by Terry Mugler. I love this fragrance so much. I love it so much that I wish every woman would have this in their collection. Now, I know some people like what they like. But this fragrance, when I smell this fragrance, you guys, I'm, I've only had this in my collection for a little over a year now. One of my friends, shout out to my full figure life, Ashley, she put me on to this fragrance and I'm so glad this was my favorite the moment I smelled it, you guys. This is a oriental floral fragrance. And when I tell you, all you need is one spray. Spray it in your areas that you spray and you're going to be good to go. You guys. This scent smells so good. I would wear this all day, every day. My signature scent. This will be my signature scent. I constantly grab this. This is my third bottle of this, you guys, in a year and a half. I constantly grab for this. I want this for Christmas. I want this for New Year's. I want this for my birthday. I want this anytime that I can get this. I want this. If you want to buy me anything, get me this. I don't care about nothing else. Get me Alien. I love Alien so much. Terry Mugler. This has been out since 2003, you guys. This is an oldie but a goodie. Um, Yes, you guys. This right here, I honestly do not care if anybody says, oh, this is overrated. Everybody has this. I don't want to smell like everybody. I don't care about that, you guys. This smells so good you need this in your collection there is absolutely nothing to me on the market out better than alien alien i'm gonna tell you why alien is, is so good not only does it smell amazing it makes you smell and feel absolutely beautiful i can wear this all day long i can wear this with little black dress i can wear this going out wearing nothing you know what i mean like just if i want to smell good i can wear this if i want to smell good going to bed i can wear this but it is very powerful. It's in your face. It's bossy. You guys, this is the most compliments out of all my fragrances that I showed you guys today. This one gets the most compliments. And I love compliments when I wear a perfume. This one, I get compliments from men, women, children, little boys, little girls. They all love the way this smells. There is something in this fragrance that makes you addicted to that scent. It's, it's scientific. They went scientific with this fragrance. I'm pretty sure they do that with all fragrances, but especially with Alien, there's something in it that makes it click in your nose, click in your brain, and it makes you addicted to it. This is an oriental floral scent. It smells, it smells incredible. The most beautiful scent I've ever smelled in my entire life. And I know that might sound like a bold statement <laughs> because there are so many thousands upon thousands of fragrances out there. But I have yet to find anything that outweighs or beats Alien. If you guys have any suggestions or if you know something that smells better than this, let me know. I'm open to try new things. We're going to have more perfume um, videos going forward. But Alien is my all-time favorite. I love this fragrance. This was the fragrance that put me in into really getting addicted to fragrance and loving fragrance and, lo and knowing what it is that I like in a fragrance. I love oriental. I love warm, um, warm fragrances. I love gourmand fragrances. I want to smell like a, a goddess. I want to, I want to smell like you can eat me. I like that as well. 
Uh, I think that's called Gourmand. Uh, I think that's called Gourmand. I'm not, I'm not sure. Like I said, I'm still learning. But Alien, you guys, you cannot beat it. I think every woman should have Alien in their collection. Alien, I would say, is very uh, sophisticated. So if you don't want to smell sophisticated, if you don't want to smell like a bad if you don't want to smell like too much and too much, if you don't like bold scents, this is not going to be for you. I do think that Alien would be too grown. I, I saw somebody say that they were 13 wearing Alien. I feel like that's too grown in my opinion. I'm not letting my 13 year old wear Alien. That's that's too too mature, too advanced for me in my opinion. But Alien, you guys, is the most beautiful scent. It's my all time favorite. If I could only have one perfume for the rest of my life, this would be it, you guys. An oldie but a goodie, okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. These were my top five fragrances that I think you should definitely put in your collection. You definitely need. Leave your comments down below letting me know what fragrances you love the most. If there's anything that you want me to try out, I'd be happy to do that. What is your favorite fragrance? What is your favorite scent? What have you come across recently in 2022 that you recently put in your collection? Please let me know down below. Again, this is a segment that we're going to have on this channel at least two to three times a week. I'm sorry, two to three times a month because I'm trying to get my collection back up, you guys, and talk more about perfume and um, bringing a new year with a bang. And I'm super excited to be back filming for you guys. So yes, you guys, Man Killer. I don't know what I'm going to title the video yet, but definitely Man Killer top five fragrances that you should have in your collection. Um, yeah, you won't be disappointed. Let me know what you guys think, and I will see you guys tomorrow for another video. I love you. Bye. Mwah.